Time now for run and shoot. Deshaun Watson threw for 420 yards and three touchdowns, including the game winner in the title game last night. John, the Jets have got to get this guy in the draft. Please, Lord. You think he's the Jet quarterback of the future? I, I believe in him. And I'm going to tell you what, I don't think he's going to make it to the Jets. I think Cleveland is going to take him because that's what Cleveland do. They take bad quarterbacks or they take any quarterback. <laughs> but I tell you what, the Jets are at the point where they'll take anybody. Fitz didn't work out. Geno's a free agent. They don't have a guy on their roster currently that can win them six games. So if you got a young guy, this guy showed grit. He showed tough. He got a, He took a hit in the first quarter, and I thought he was done for yeah. the game. But he rallied back in that second half, and he played lights out. I, to play in the NFL, I'll tell you what, to be a quarterback, you're going to need some moxie and toughness. You're going to take some hits. And he, he, what he was able to do in the second half, come back and rally, lead that team, make some big throws. I love him. I hope they pick him. Look, I don't doubt what you're saying at all about this. I think he's a very special sure. player. But whenever the Jets take a quarterback coming out of college and want to put him right in, look at Hackenberg this year. I don't think he's ever going to see the field. Geno Smith, he was the answer. Look what, what happened with Geno. Nothing. They end up going with an old veteran like Fitzpatrick. Sure. Good last year, not so good this year. I think the Jets are better off getting another quarterback that's been in the league for a little while yeah. until they need know they could get a quarterback that's as close to a short thing as you can get and then make sure he blossoms. Hackenberg could have been that guy, but everything I hear and see not makes ready. it seem like he's not ready. He's and not ready. if you're a second round pick, you should be ready by the end of your first year. With Deshaun Watson, I think that he might be that guy, but like you said, I don't think he's falling down to the Jets. No, at the end of the day, you also got to realize one thing. The Jets need more than a quarterback. Yeah. So if you can go get a tight end, outside linebacker or another stud left tackle because listen Clayton's not back they lost to Bergeron Ferguson this line this offensive line needs help we'll see what happens you said tight end I love OJ Howard you watched him last night you watched him in last year's national championship game this guy is a special tight end yes. he is a hybrid kind of a guy he can block he can run he would be a huge asset to the New York Jets because right now and tight Giants. Ends go, yeah and the Giants and as well Giants. any NFL team because like these guys are really really special and if you can grab one early like Howard who's got this experience playing in the you know the national championship game every year because you're Alabama he could be a difference maker when you look at the Jets weapons this year sure. tight end just wasn't an option it it wasn't an option and then Chance Gailey offers needed a tight end you need a tight end who's a willing blocker, a guy who could stretch the chains, a guy that could be a safety net for a struggling quarterback. They had none of that. So if you can get a guy in the draft and possibly pick this O.J. Howe kid, big guy, put him in the flex, let him run a skinny post, a willing block on the outside, you may have something special. Now, Jets pick early. Is it too early to take somebody like O.J. Howard in their spot? No, because I feel like you always draft, at least draft the best player. If he's the best player on the board, you got to take him. You got to start filling this roster with guys who are willing ball players and guys who want to make the franchise better. Because right now, the Jets are in a very sensitive position. Come free agents that want to look for new teams, they're not going to be picking the New York Jets.